Hi reception. Hi, I hope you're, you're okay. So last week we were learning about measuring weight and we would like to have a look at this again and what we're going to do is see what you have learned. So we're going to do some predicting and finding out what happens to objects when we place them on our scales. So if you have any of the objects that we're weighing, I wonder if you can pause the video, go and find them and see if you can weigh along with us, maybe using your arms as the scales. So here on our screen, you can see a picture of one apple and some scales. And I wonder if you can have a little think, maybe tell a grown up or say it out loud. What do you think will happen when we put the apple on the scales? You could show this using your arm. So what do you think will happen to the scales when we put the apple on one side? Have a little think. That's right. Look, as you can see, the apple has tipped the scales. So it's made the scales on the apple side go down and the other side has gone up and that's because the apple is heavier than nothing than air so the apple has made the scales go down look the apple is now on the other side of the scales i wonder if you can predict what's going to happen now to the scales think about what miss solomon was saying before shall we see what happens that's right, the, sc the scales have tipped the other way because the apple is heavier than nothing. And now we have two objects on our screen. So we have a shoe on one side and a feather on the other. So if you have these or anything like this, go and get them and you can join in. What do you think will happen when we place the shoe and the feather at the same time on the scales. Use your arms to have, a, to have a go. Show your adult. That's right. The shoe tipped the scales down and the feather went up into the air. And that's because the shoe is heavier than the feather and the feather is lighter than the shoe. Oh, now we've got an empty glass and a full glass of fizzy pop. I wonder what's going to happen now to the scales. Can you pause the video and predict with your arms? Show a grown up. Well done if you guessed that right. So the full cup is heavier than the cup with nothing in, isn't it? You're right. And now we have two items, two things that are the same. So we have two socks here. So I wonder what will happen when we place the socks on our scales. Can you show a grown up with your arms? Oh, look, that's right. The scales didn't move. And that's because the socks weigh the same. So they have balanced our scales because they are equal weight they weigh the same so the scale has not gone up or down on one side both sides have stained equal the same thank you everybody for making really good predictions today and having another practice at weighing with us we will see you soon bye, bye everyone